Yo, wait, listen. I want you to help me out with something. You know how we've been hearing about all these ambushes in Iraq and Afghanistan? Well, I think someone needs to communications to our enemies. I want you to look out for anything coming out of the Army or the private contractors who have access to that kind of income. With me. Thanks, man. I'll catch you later. We're enough.
Satan! There he is. About time. This bill will replace our enlisted force with a profit-driven army. It's completely absurd. Is this true, Senator? Your bill would privatize the military? What Senator Whitehorse seems to be forgetting is that our enlisted forces just lost an aircraft carrier to terrorists. And that's not to mention all of the recent ambushes and unnecessary casualties. You see, war isn't what it used to be. The rules of engagement don't apply anymore. 
Time and time again, we've seen that private corporations are better and more adept at handling this kind of threat. To put it simply, if the military isn't able to take care of business, we need someone who is. I talked to Section 8 and he thinks someone is leaking U.S. troop positions to our enemies. You gotta chill on the conspiracy theories, man. Well, he thinks it's coming from inside SSC. Must be the Illuminati. Abort, boys, abort. Make your way to the evac point now. A chopper's on the way. You've been reassigned to a new mission. This is a big one. We've found the constellation, 200 miles west of Manila Bay. The Philippine government thinks their navy can handle it, but the DOD thinks differently, which is why they hired us. Your mission is to take control of the ship from the terrorist hijackers. You'll parachute onto the carrier. Philip Clyde will be with you. What the? Clyde? Hell no! We're not working with him anymore! Hey, Dalton says it's a three-man job. You don't have a choice. You guys should touch down near the rear of the carrier, then make your way up to the control tower. These terrorists are with Abu Sayyaf, one of the most powerful terror organizations in the world. We don't know what their plans are, but as long as you two do your job, we'll never have to find out. Everything clear? Yeah, we got it. We're on our way! Yeah. Alright, I'll contact you as soon as we have more details. Corpses back to Dalton. Look, we ain't any happier to be doing this with you than you are to be doing it with us. So let's just stay out of each other's hair and get this thing done. No problem, fucko. Fucko? Who says that? Hey, Alice, we're on deck. We're heading for the control tower. Hold on. We can't let any more of those terrorists get out of the air. There's four jets on the carrier runway near the blast doors. Disable the jet's ignition system.
Christ, they got me! We may have to use it. Get behind me. Stay 
close, soldier. I'm on it. on this laptop. Shit, a flash drive. Wonder what's on here. jump. Over. What the hell are you doing? What? We should tell her about Clyde. Not until we know what's going on. I plug that USB drive into my GPS, and Section 8 is gonna look at it remotely. Don't say anything until he tells us what's up. Need some help?
You know how I thought someone was leaking U.S. troop positions to our enemies? Well, Section 8 hacked into the drive we found, and he says it was Clyde. That drive is full of troop positions and transaction records with terrorists and enemies. You all right, sir? I'll be all right. We got a real situation here. This ship's loaded up with stolen nuclear warheads. They're controlling the ship, and they've booby-trapped the engine room. Try and get in there, and she'll blow quicker than a tie hooker. And we're on a collision course for downtown Manila. You've got to be shitting me. I'm a Navy captain. Bullshitting ain't in my job description. Now listen. The Navy SEALs are on their way, but we can't wait. I need you to help me bring this ship to the bottom before she reaches Manila. Of course. We'll do it. Good. Now take the elevators down to Hangar B. Pass through that hangar to Hangar C. I'll give you further instructions over the radio. And, uh, good luck. Seems like today, luck just ain't in our job description. What the hell is going on? Why did you leave the captain on the bridge? He was hurt. Over. This thing's turned into a real nightmare. The captain says there's nuclear weapons on board and we can't control the engine. We gotta help him bring the ship down before we reach Manila. What? What are you gonna do? We're working with the captain. We'll take care of it. Then we'll head back to the bridge and get him out of here. Over. Seals saving the day. Shit, bro. That's fucking Pedro. Clyde did this. He killed Pedro, and he killed Eisenhower. Eisenhower died in Iraq. You saw him die. Clyde leaked those troop positions. He's responsible for what happened to Eisenhower. Pedro, man. Eisenhower. They were the only ones left from our Ranger squad. I can't believe it. Oh. It's cool, Dice. I got you covered. Harris, the cowboy contractor. Where the hell are you? Let me help you up. Uh, 
military contractors, the very same private contractors you put in power with your bill to privatize the military. You want to replace a military which has safeguarded our country for 240 years with corporations who profit from war. Richard, you know as well as I do that it's not about what I want. Elliot, where the hell are you? It's about what the American Hello, people want. Hello, are you want. listening to me? Can I help? Call you right back. The American people want to end this war. It's about time you got here. And when they go to the polls this November, they'll vote for the only military that can do that. The private military. Senator Whitehorse, this bill will pass. Over my dead body it will. I I'm sorry, we need to take a quick commercial break. We'll be right back with Senators Richter and Whitehorse debating the bill to privatize... Murray wants us to do another mission. What? 
You said you wouldn't talk to her till we figured out if she's working with Clyde, leaking troop positions. It's Murray, man. We can trust her. Besides, we already agreed we're gonna quit and go public with the evidence. What does it matter if we do one last mission? Come on, man. I can really use the cash. All right, Alice. When you go. You'll be heading to China. Sibu Mohammed is the terrorist mastermind who orchestrated the capture of the USS Constellation. He's the head of Abu Sayyaf and one of the most wanted men in the world. He's staying at the Jiang Min Hotel in the cliffs overlooking the Lijiang River. He's extremely well guarded, so you won't be able to get close to him. He's dead. Your instructions are to destroy this bridge as his convoy passes over it in the morning. If Mohammed's bodyguards pursue you, head down river and radio for extraction once you've lost them. Everything clear? Yeah. Yeah. What the hell are you guys doing in South Korea anyway? Just helping out an old friend. <laughs> <laughs>